Connor Bedard, first multi-point game of his NHL career, 4.9. He leads the Hawks in scoring, by the way, 11 points in 12 games. Um, we talked a lot about him, but what else caught your eye about this kid in this impressive well, performance? Well, what I love about Connor Bedard now is we all know he has the great shot, right? That's how he built his junior career and the highlight goals and everything. But now he's adding another dimension to, and many d other dimensions to his game, like physical battle, winning against Victor Henman, down low, and then getting to the front of the net to present a stick. That's so important to be able to add as a player in the NHL. Creativity. Like, he shows the back end to everybody, almost to tease them, and then he gives the puck away. How about the sick check and then the drive to the net and the patient? Unreal. Like, there's so many other layers to his game right now that make him spectacular. That is why he went first overall. And obviously, for me, if he's going to have that passing ability, that playmaking ability that he showed on the Corey Perry goal, like, this is going to be danger for everybody because every time he has the puck and everybody's thinking, He's going to shoot. He's going yeah. to shoot. No, he can still make that pass. It's going to be a lot of guessing for goaltenders around the NHL. And when you start guessing, pucks go in, and it's never a good thing for goalies, but it's a great thing for him and the, the Hawks. I know you've watched him a lot. Is he, is he better than you actually expected him to be coming into the league this year? I would say no, because my expectations of Connor Bedard were exactly what Connor McDavid did, what Austin Matthews did, and I think he's right there. Maybe not at the same exact level because – you know, the Hawks are not going to compete like right. the Oilers or the Leafs were when Matthews and McDavid got into the league. But I think it's – my expectations were high. I think highly of young players that come in that have all the talent. So he's not, you know, below or above expectation is right where I thought he'd be. At the end of the season, maybe it's like a point a game. Like, right. wouldn't that be amazing if he finished <laughs> with 80 points? It would just be incredible. And, you know, some people predicted it. I didn't think it would be possible. And it's very much within reach – for Connor Bedard, youngest player in Blackhawk, Blackhawks history with a multi-goal game, youngest player to get three points in the first period since Pierre Turgeon back in 1987.